where are we now? Can you just explain where we are? We're in the bathroom at Easy Street, obviously. Obviously, uh, where's Easy Street? Tell us more. In the hallway. Can you do four full sentences anymore? Yeah. Good. Should get the whole well. <laughs> yeah. I, I, <laughs> this is seven pounds of a drink. You see what I'm drinking here? This is killing me. Seven pounds. <laughs> seven pounds. I feel like seven pounds of drink. Thomas, don't let the taxi hit you, you f face. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, oh, cool. Uh, yeah. Hey, girl. <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. Well, that was like the person earlier that we walked by and they were like, make me famous. No, guys, we thought they were giving FYI, a when she laughed, She said, nice legs. And then when she drove, oh, you're... she said, I just wanted to get another look at the legs. She That's what she said? Legs. Yeah. <laughs> she likes your stupid chicken legs. Hey, babe, look at this. We don't know she wasn't to, talking I about you my hand box. that yeah. muscle right there. See that muscle? Yeah, that's your... Scrooge yeah, picked up. <laughs> saying Gotta like, have my MT. I was saying, you're like the gayest Disney afternoon ever. <laughs> um, he just likes to spend money. Gets him off. Whether it's in an antique shop or a bakery, this or guy, a bathhouse. he's like, I just must buy pies and bread and big <laughs> wine glasses and lampshades and, and fire anvils that look like cats and dogs and Ooh, griffins. Where's and, one of those? Well, over the griffin shop. Oh, you had the, the fire oh, griffin. Right. Yeah. Well, they're four hundred. No, sphinxy. They were like sphinxy griffin. I, I have to get that. I have to get that approved. You know, yeah. That kind of giant purchase. Yeah. Let's do an intro. <laughs> oh, that was an intro. Uh, we're at Slate's in Hollowell. Uh, so we're starting our day. We're going to have some brunch. Uh, we're going to have some wine. We already had our cocktails going. Uh, this is what's going to prime us for the rest of our debauchery. We're laying the foundation for the rest of our day. And Joel, who knows more about laying a foundation than Joel Beauchamp? <laughs> Joel. That's my job before I quit that tip. Bob Vila Beauchamp. <laughs> I moved up from Boston. You know, I wanted to. I wanted to start a restaurant where I could cook wonderful things, and, and there wasn't really anything in the town at all. That's why I started it. You know, I just wanted to be a cook. Uh, so we have quite a uh, pretty impressive spread here uh, in front of us for brunch, covering it looks like a lot of bases. Uh, I immediately grabbed the Benedict to put in front of me, uh, which looks like it has lobster in it, right? It's a lobster artichoke Benedict. Lobster artichoke Benedict. Yeah. Over here it looks like he's got some French toast with toast bananas and strawberries and cinnamon raisin French toast. And, French toast. The uh, and then we have it looks like a salad of roasted beets yeah. with cashews, no. mixed greens. What kind of vinaigrette on that? It's a house vinaigrette, which is sort of like a soy vinaigrette. Soy vinaigrette. So you see what we've got going on here. We've got the bowl made of tortilla with eggs and salsa, black beans. Uh, the home fries look amazingly caramelized and delicious. I, look at this. Yeah. It's all about the crispy tortilla. Right yeah, the crispy tortilla bowl on the huevos. That's what it's all about. Ham shaped. It's like taco salad on steroids. <laughs> <laughs> out of the way. Uh, I'm feeling good, pushing on here. I think what I like the most about that, well, there's actually a really great spread of food that they put out, uh, a little bit of everything. The Benedict was delicious. Obviously, the home fries and the huevos rancheros were wonderful. Uh, I have to admit that after the fact, I finished the rest of the beets and cashews because they were actually delicious too, whereas Joel just ate the mayo. Uh, 
which I seemed like a, mayo. which is why Joel has the physique he has, and I have my Beats and Cashews physique that I have. It's not, it's not the Joel has mayo in his hair <laughs> code. Not the yeah. hair, you know. Joel, Joel, just not the face, <laughs> Bochamp. <laughs> Hollowell, it's an it's a drinking town with an antiques problem. Apparently, it's 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 a, it's a drinking town with an antique problem. Well, antique town with a drinking problem, but backwards, obviously, you know. It used to be known as the antique capital of Maine because there were more antique shops here than anywhere else in in, in Maine, but not anymore. You know what the antique capital is now? Uh, probably Wiscasset. I have no idea. <laughs> Uh, we, our show is about eating and drinking, but we wanted to take time to make sure we that. came into, yeah. As you can see, I'm, you know, my antiquing physique and... Right, looks <laughs> charming. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I, I get these clothes custom fit. <laughs> known for. Um, we brew over 20 different beers. We have about six on at a time. Um, we have a couple staples that we have, you know, all the time. And then we have a lot of seasonal beers as well. Uh, and then we're also known for our pub food. One thing you must do while at the Liberal Cup is get the beer and cheese soup. Uh, sometimes, as, as, as often as daily, they change the beer and the cheese in the soup. And they actually use pretzels as croutons. Why the f*** didn't I think of that? It's delicious, right? It's like it's like eating cheese sauce with delicious pretzels. Here, let me feed you some with a pretzel. So we just left the Liberal Cup, <laughs> where great times were had by all of these very nice people. I think I'm gonna uh, take a like a three minute break. I think I need from eating and drinking. Just a quick three minutes yeah. to regroup myself. Yeah. And uh, we're going to uh, Easy Street next. Uh, if I'm gonna go to a beach party, I gotta f digest, man. I can't be eating nachos. Yeah, we're gonna be playing volleyball. Ooh. What? You're I'm, definitely volleyball. I'm gonna spike the volleyball <laughs> right at you, Steed. Yeah, yeah, he's gonna shove a hot pepper up your <laughs> too. <laughs> well, every time we, when I go to a bar, like before I go in, I announce, I'm going into this bar now. You are at Easy Street Lounge, and I am Bruce Mayo. It's a very, you know, it's a very open town. There's a, very, there's a lot of, you know, gay and lesbian population. But whatever, I, I'm not really into that, but hey, whatever. You either get it or you don't. <laughs> Before I owned this place, I worked at, actually the last two places that you visited today, I worked at both places. I started at Slate's when I was 17 and uh, I actually managed the cup for four years. So I'm my own owner now, so when I'm, so I can dress like this anytime I want. <laughs> Easy Street. It's a bar that's in a basement that's amazing. It's like your rich friend's basement. Yeah. Where you can just sit up with that sh 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 Shut up. Shut up. <laughs> where you can have amazing food and eat nachos in a bathroom and nobody's gonna give you like I mean, this is all you want. have one first while we're here. <laughs> Oh, 
<laughs> we <laughs> wrecked it in Hollowell today. How many, how many Mai Tais? I had like a, probably three if each, buckets. If, each <laughs> if three buckets of Mai Tai. I am <laughs> I'm okay, I will admit it. First time I'm <laughs> up. I drank a lot. I'm drunk. I don't get drunk often, I drink a lot, I'm drunk. I got drunk off Mai Tais like some kind of Did he say Joel. I drink a lot? <laughs> 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 I figured why hold back, but luckily it, it had a little interracial mingling <laughs> with one of the vanilla cupcakes uh, that neighbored it, so I got a little bit of swirl cone experience happening in my mouth here. Yeah. Oh. Mm. 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 <laughs> Guess who's coming yeah. to dinner, man? <laughs> <laughs> Monster Squad. <laughs> it's a good film, but I mean, you know, I can't believe kids are into Twilight these days. And like, we had Monster Squad, and they have Twilight. Yeah, totally. I think this um, Kokomo beverage is kicking my. Although we have to enforce our strict no Kokomo policy on Fukuoka TV. Fun to hang out with us all, isn't it? Sorry. This is the best part of doing the show is you get to hang out with us, which you wouldn't normally get to do, Kurt. Yeah. Somebody fought. Yeah, it does. Yeah, that's how we didn't fart. Yeah, you fart. Okay, I was like, somebody fighted. I think. Yeah. <laughs> a, Alex fighted. Smells like a nerd. <laughs> Nerds, kick him in the nerds. Wolfman's got nards. <laughs> Monster Squad. <laughs> Dude, dance until your feet fall off. <laughs> Rock until you drop. Are you wearing British mate? No. BK? I'm wearing Adidas SWAT boots, mother. Are those your Adidas Montel Jordan edition? <laughs> Step I take, and uh, you will be there. Place. Every little step I make will be soon gone. Every little step I take, easy street now. Every little step I make will be together.